As an athletic director here at Randolph, when I'm looking to fill a vacant spot from a coach, some of the, the characteristics I'm looking for, first and foremost, I always ask, do you want to coach here? I mean, a lot of people want to coach, I think they want to get into the business, but I ask them, what do you know about Randolph? Because that tells me that they've done some research, they really understand what they're getting into, they're, they understand the, the student population, the dynamics they're going to be working with here, because they may come from another situation where it was this way, they had more finances or something like that, or just had you know better fields, or whatever the case may be. And then they get here and they get really frustrated. And then young people can read that body language better than anybody else. And if they can tell you're not really invested in them and that you really don't care, then they're not gonna they're gonna tune you out. I also look for people who really care about our people, students here. Do you really care about what happens to that young athlete beyond the playing services? You can't fake that. You can fool me as an adult once in a while, but you can't fool the students. They'll know if you really care. And if they know you care, they'll go through the wall for you or they'll give you everything they got. I also look for coaches who will have, obviously have an expertise in the sport itself. Are they good teachers and good communicators? And are they organized? You know, do they come in neat presentation? Do they come to practice with a plan that's written out so everyone can see it? Or are they winging it off the top of their head, which means, you know, erratic practices? I also look for coaches, again, who are committed to the values we have here. Education, um, family, community, being involved in that. Coaches who had experience working with diverse student populations, because Randolph is one of the most diverse student, diverse populations in the state of Massachusetts. Our community has been ranked for that. Uh, so I want coaches to understand exactly when you come here, you have to be sensitive to that. You have to know that you're going to be dealing with students from different backgrounds, but they will. the expectation that you have for them shouldn't be lowered, if that makes sense. You need to have the same expectation you'd have if you coach them anywhere else, and that you're going to push them to their limits but you're gonna support them in every way you can so that they can be successful, whether that means making a phone call to a potential college coach who might come out and see our student athletes, uh, taking them on a field trip to a college campus. Many of our student athletes have not taken a trip to a college game to know that that's the next level for them, and that it's even a possibility. So I look for coaches with those characteristics. Obviously, we all want winning coaches, but you know, do, not, do you win at all costs? That's not the coach that I really want here. You, know, you take shortcuts, or it's all about winning. If you're not about developing young people and developing their relationship, this is probably not going to be the best place for you.